Good morning and welcome to our prayer message coming to you from our beautiful courtyard here at Carmel Mission Basilica. Uh, this week we are focusing on the theme of fatherhood. And uh, of course, it would not be complete without including some wonderful Irish poetry. So today I want to share with you a poem by uh, one of my favorite Irish poets, Patrick Kavanagh. And if you think, hasn't he read some of his stuff before? Yes, I have. And uh, we actually used one of his poems on Mother's Day, celebration of Mother's Day, in memory of my mother. And uh, believe it or not, the poem we're going to read with you you today is called In Memory of My Father. He was born, Patrick was, in rural Inneskeen, County Monaghan, the fourth of ten children, born into a farming family. And while he appeared as a, a cobbler and farmer with his father, his heart was always uh, immersed in literature. He sought the mentorship of George William Russell, a leader of the Irish literary revival. And his first collection, Ploughman and Other Poems, was published in 1936, notable for its realistic, unsentimental portrayal of Irish country life. After a brief time in London, he settled in Dublin and later Belfast, working as an author, a poet, and a part-time journalist. He also was a part-time bartender, and the goalkeeper for his amateur Gaelic football club. Patrick Kavanagh passed away in 1967. It is said uh, that his poetry is marked by a profound simplicity that he was so close to the earth. He captures the seemingly mundane, the details of life and shows us how rich they can truly be. In this poem, he is reminded of his father as he nears the anniversary of his passing. Every old man that he sees reminds him. And there's no commentary on the phenomena, just a realization that those we love are never truly gone when we carry them in our hearts. In memory of my father, Every old man I see reminds me of my father. When he had fallen in love with death, one time when sheaves were gathered. That man I saw in Gardner Street stumble on the curb was one. He stared at me half-eyed. I might have been his son. And I remember the musician faltering over his fiddle in Bayswater, London. He too set me the riddle. Every old man I see in October colored weather, weather seems to say to me, I was once your father. As always, I invite you to send your prayer requests to Father Rodrigo and myself. Just go to our mission website, carmelmission.org and press on that prayer request button and we will be very happy to take your intentions with us during our daily prayers and masses. I continue to wish you and your loved ones uh, blessings of good health, a great peace, and uh, more consciousness of the wonderful love of our Heavenly Father. Thank you.